even better to know that your songs are on everyone's lips. When you're doing them, they're singing them word for word. Kevin Anthony is a famous Jamaican singer whose expertise are producer, songwriter, reggae, dancehall, lovers rock, and gospel. He's widely known to many as Sanchez. Let me tell you that Sanchez, the reggae icon, accomplished one Grammy Award, four DJ Awards, and also one International Dance Music Award. So during his prolific career, he scored six competitive awards from 26 nominations. Know that your songs are on everyone's lips. When you're doing them, they're singing them word for word. So it's, it's, it's a great feeling. Please viewers and subscribers, remember share the link on all social media platforms and watch the ads and comment, share and like because it do help us out a lot. His full name is Kevin Anthony Jackson. He's a true born Jamaican. By my knowledge and understanding, he's a Sagittarius who grew up in Stony Hill and Waterford era. The reggae legend born November the 30th, 1964, and he would be 57 years old at the time of this production. Sanchez's wife goes by the name Miss Monica Jackson. Both Sanchez and Miss Monica bear children together, who goes by the name Christopher, Kevian, Anastasia, and also Christian. The reggae icon affiliation labels are Dennis Star Records, Vina Records, Green Sleeve Records, and many more. Let me tell you that during the reggae star time, growing up at a tender age, Sanchez was a skillful football player. However, his associate, who we would refer to as friend, decided to give him the nickname Sanchez. So basically, the reggae star name after a great football player goes by the name Alexis Sanchez, who played for Chile, the national football team. Did you know that Sanchez started music from an early age? He began singing in choir at the Rehoboth, Apostolical Church in St. Catherine. Believe it or not, Sanchez working for several sound systems. First as a selector, working with Mango Sound System in the 1987. Sanchez cut his first single with Redman, a song called Lady in Red, and by 1988, Sanchez was one of Jamaica's popular singers. Oh, I don't seem to be caught up inside a dream all my life. In the same period of time, which is 1988, Sanchez was also on a show called Reggae Sun Splash. However, the reggae icon blasted the show and was called back for six end chords. Let me tell you that Sanchez cut tremendous hit songs with a lot of producers such as Winston Riley, Philip Fattis Burrell, King Jammy, Bobby Digital and Donovan Jermaine. Nevertheless, Sanchez also cut a do-over version of Tracy Chapman's song entitled Baby Can I Hold You. Which was included on Fattis Burrell's number one album in 1989. In 2000, Sanchez's album entitled Simple Being Me made a success of hitting number 14 on the US Billboard top reggae album chart. Moreover, in 2002, Sanchez sang Stay On My Mind hit number 9 on the billboard also. Sanchez is known for his amazing love songs and cover version of pop and R&B. Songs in the 1990, Sanchez mixed gospel themes with other topics on his albums. In the 1999, he released the gospel song entitled who is this man? Sanchez love across the world by many fans because of his terrific songs. Songs such as Brown Eye Girl, Can We Talk, Missing You, Bring Back the Love, and many more viewers and subscribers. In 2012, Sanchez revealed that he is now a full-time producer and has been working with engineer Rodney Tinoir Lion. And in May, he, re he revealed that he was working on two self-produced albums. One is dancehall, like a general, and one is gospel, and there is no other like you. So viewers and subscribers, remember, comment, share, subscribe, and like. When you don't know everything we are going to know and everything we are going to get, we just have to go in our briefing, because we can't make reggae die, you see? I'm El Chapa Scott TV, the best TV. I'm out. Jaggy Jaggy.
please viewers and subscribers remember share the link on all social media platforms and watch the ads and comment share and like because it do help us out a lot